Manitoba Liquor Marts presents The Great Tastes of Manitoba. Hi everyone, welcome once again to Great Tastes of Manitoba. It is my pleasure to introduce to you our newest member of the Great Taste family, Adriana Barros. How's that? Good, thank you very much. You're very welcome, nice to have you here. A new name on the show and a new brand now called Manitoba Beef Producers. There you go. And Al Bonas, of course, with uh, his, his, his picks that we'll get to later on. Uh, but first of all now, you have to tell all of us what you're doing today, uh, especially so that Al has an idea of what he has to go hunt for. All right, so tonight is gonna be all about quick weeknight dinners. So we're doing quick nutritious meals with time left in your evening to um, get some things done. So first is our beefy meatballs and spaghetti squash. Oh, this is paired yeah. with some tomato sauce, Parmesan cheese and fresh basil. Second is our Dijon crusted sirloin pasta salad. This is done with some crumbled feta cheese, a New York strip loin and it's a uh, vinaigrette based dressing as well as our third is my favorite, Manitoba grilled steak and brie sandwiches with sweet pears, creamy brie cheese, and ciabatta bites. Oh, wow. Grilled steak and brie. sounds like How kind of a meal, huh? Yeah, uh, um, Adriana, the, the, uh, the meatballs and spaghetti squash. Now, spaghetti squash, I'm assuming that's just squash made into spaghetti? It certainly is. It's a really great alternative to those who want to either um, intake low carbohydrates or who are gluten. Um, intolerance, so it's a really great option, and it's locally found in Manitoba. And yeah, it still kind of has that look and feel of, of, it uh, does. of, of yes. spaghetti. Yeah. Yes. Well, that's great. I'll, uh, I'm looking forward to bringing something for that. Off you go. Thanks, Al. See you in a, a bit later. Okay, Adriana. Okay, so let's get started on our meatballs. So into our ground beef, I'm going to add some chopped white onions. Mm -hmm. I have some garlic. Garlic. We're going to go with some Parmesan cheese. That helps it uh, stick it all together. Yeah, it? and it gives it a really great flavor. And at home, if you're making your own meatballs, it's always nice to put a little less or put a little more if you'd like. Okay, so here's our spice blend. So I have some dried basil, oregano, salt, ground pepper, some nutmeg that pairs really well with the spaghetti squash, and some red pepper flakes. So I'm just going Ooh, to okay, mix lots that of spices all there. in there. Yes, this is a little spicy. So if you are cooking for young children or those who don't um, want to have that spicy of a dish, you can definitely omit or half the quantity of um, pepper in that. And that's a full egg. That's a full or just egg. Just egg yolk. And that's a whole egg. Yeah. So that's going to nicely bind things together. So if you'd like, you can go ahead and. Um, Mix, mix that up. all together. Okay, I yeah. could use a fork, but I'm going to use Go my hands. Go ahead and use your hands. hands. I only had time to rotate two of the tires on my vehicle earlier <laughs> today, but uh, they're very clean, very clean. <laughs> clean hands, perfect. So today we're going to be using a extra lean ground sirloin um, ground beef, and these are very easy to find in local grocery stores. Um, yeah, just out of curiosity, I, I was wondering how, how big is the beef industry in this province? The beef industry in Manitoba is definitely thriving and is large. Um, just this year alone, the goods and services um, contributed by our Manitoba beef producers was $635 million. So they're definitely boosting our economy and bringing a lot of beef products to you and I everywhere. Good. So. There's the beef. Yeah, so once you're done that, we can form a meatball either with your hands or we can do it with a meatball scoop here. Yeah, we could, but we yeah. probably won't. Okay. I think we'll do it. But that's so a nice, that's interesting a, little thing. That's a good option if you don't want to get your hands dirty and it's quick and easy. Yeah. So those are going into the oven at 375 for 15 minutes until they're cooked to well done. So that's 160 Fahrenheit or 71 degrees Celsius. So you have a um, fully cooked meatball. Mm -hmm. So once they're out of the oven, we can throw that together with our pasta sauce. I'm using just a tomato basil sauce. You can just heat that thoroughly um, together and warm it up. Okay, so our next step is going to get to that spaghetti squash. So what I have here is our spaghetti squash. Um, the easiest way I've found to 
make squash is in the microwave. So what you want to do is pierce the um, surface of the squash just with the knife. Just this will allow the steam to escape while you're um, while it's being cooked. You cook it whole. I do cook it whole, yes. I just find it easier to cut once it's been cooked. Oh yeah, probably, I'm sure it is, softer. Mm -hmm, it's much softer. So you remove the seeds and then you're left with something that looks just like this. You can already see all the strands going into there. So all I do with a fork is just scrape this just like this and you can already see it's forming the spaghetti. So what I like to do and what's fun for entertaining is I have already a hollowed out squash and I like to use it um, for my serving dish. So I have here some squash I've taken out from there. So what we're going to do is just fill this back up. And then what you can do is top that with your spaghetti and meatballs. So Jim, do you want to just grab the... The meatballs? The, the meatballs here and you can go ahead and scoop some on. This is a fun way of entertaining at home, and it's quick enough to do during the week. And fun. There you go. Yeah, it's really fun. Look at this. There you Look go. Look at that. On the Perfect. other side. Let's just leave that yeah. for now. We'll so let this that cool ready to just go. a little. It's quite hot. We'll take a very fast break. We want you to be back when we come back because we have two more terrific beef dishes waiting for you.